Well, we can cross live now to Los Angeles and talk to actor Jimmy Jean-Louis, who stars in the hit TV series Heroes. He has relatives living in Haiti. Jimmy, thanks for joining us. Have you managed to get in touch with your mum and dad now? Because I know earlier you hadn't been able to reach them. Yes, this morning, finally, I was able to speak to my mum. And uh, she's physically OK. My dad is also physically OK. But mentally, they are very touched. What else have they said to you? Because obviously you have other relatives there, you've got other family members. What are they saying? What are the scenes there? Well, I don't think that they've been able to go around too much. Uh, they were so worried about what happened to them. Uh, apparently, uh, my dad is not really taking it well uh, because he's been working for his whole life to build one house. And apparently, that house collapsed with somebody that's dead in the house. So he's been crying ever since, and uh, they don't know what to do. They're still sleeping outside, even though they could sleep inside the house. And, uh, and they haven't stopped crying ever since the earthquake took most of Port-au-Prince and the neighborhood. It really is devastating news. Um, it's a race against time to find people stuck uh, in the rubble. Have there been friends that you haven't been able to contact, you've been trying to contact? Well, most people I've been trying to contact, I've not been able to get in with to, to any friend. I tried at least 50 numbers before I got in, in touch with one. And then that led me to get in touch with my mom. But uh, I don't know what happened to all, all of my friends. I don't know what happened to my cousins, uncles, aunts. Uh, so I'm still in the dark. What I'm trying to do now is go down and see what's happening. But most of all, uh, it's not just about my, my close family. It's about the whole country, the catastrophe that, that, that Haiti is, is going through right now. Uh, a place like Haiti is definitely not prepared to cope with such a situation. I do not know how we're going to do it, but we definitely need the help of the whole world on this one. You're the founder for Hollywood Unites for Haiti. What do you think Haiti needs now? Uh, most, most of all, people need to donate to the big organizations, such as the Red Cross, because they know what they're doing. They're used to this kind of situations. At the same time, they can also donate to the small organizations, such as Hollywood Unites for Haiti, because we are down there and we know exactly that we can help certain portions, certain parts of, uh, of Haiti. You mentioned that you wanted to actually go to Haiti. How easy is it to get into the island? It seems to be quite difficult because uh, ever since I know that my parents are alive, I know that they need help. I've been making phone calls to try to, to go down there. Uh, the airport is closed. We could actually go from the Dominican Republic, but uh, that's not easy either because everybody's trying to go down there. So, so I'm, I'm hoping to go there ASAP, really ASAP, because I'm a bit worried for, for my parents, especially my dad.